hello and welcome back to my channel today i have uh, just a quick video for you just to review uh, this perfume this is zara neroli sunset and i just noticed that zara is uh, still having this perfume for the summer here in the uk on the website and so you can buy it right now and um, yeah so if you're new uh, welcome to my channel i'd make videos about perfumes about beauty fashion and a mix of everything so um please consider subscribing if you like this type of content so yeah let's get into the video so i just sprayed myself with this perfume uh, maybe half an hour ago but um and i thought i'm going to respray it for the video but actually this perfume is so intensive and so fresh that actually I didn't have to respray it again. So I still have it here. I can sniff it and I can review it for you. So I actually had this perfume for um, for a while now because I bought it uh, in the summer uh, last year. And uh, I actually already tested it in the heat and in the summer days. So, uh, but then I somehow put it in a drawer uh, and I've forgotten about it, but yeah, so it is actually a very good perfume, surprisingly. You can even see it, me talking about my early videos when I just started <laughs> making videos on YouTube. But um, yeah, basically this perfume has notes of lemon, orange blossom, neroli, musk and amber. And um, I would say this is very accurate. So as it's sprayed, it has this blast of uh, citrus and lemon and orange blossom and the rolling. So it's very, very fresh to start with. Um, but then it calms down a little bit. And, um, and then it becomes this very interesting scent. It's... Um, it's it is not just your usual fresh scent it it is sweet it has these the orange blossom and um, not sure about lemon it's more like an orange it's like a i would say it's more of an orange rather than lemon in the dry down and the rolly and uh, it is um very fresh to start with but then as it dries down it becomes more more sweet and musky and i guess the base in amber also makes a difference so that's why this is although this is a fresh perfume it doesn't really evaporate straight away it it does have this lasting power and even though it is obviously a very affordable perfume from zara um it's lasting um yeah pretty, pretty much um yeah like maybe three four hours and i did bearing in mind i did test it in the heat like real heat in the heat of the summer last year when it was really 30 plus degrees here in london in the hottest days and it is very long lasting it lasted through my uh sunbathing session in the park so um yeah it is a uh, very long lasting for a fresh perfume and um, i think it's great a uh, perfume for obviously uh the summer summer holidays you know something to refresh yourself and um i do recommend it and again probably my, some people might say oh does it smell cheap does it smell like uh, some sort of uh, air freshener <laughs> and the answer in my opinion is no i would not I mean, you can obviously use it as an air freshener as well if you don't like it, but um, it it has something extra to it. It's not just a basic citrusy fragrance. It has this anchor in the musk and amber. It it is you know it blends very well with my skin and yeah i i do like it and it's something i would definitely use but i would say this really suits the hot weather not just the spring like now when it's kind of hot and cold or whatever no this is the perfume for the heat for really it's boiling hot and this perfume will refresh you but still it will stick with you for 
you know, three, four hours at least, if not more. So there are some perfumes from Zara who do that. So this is uh, one of them and I did test it in the heat. So yeah, I do recommend it. And um, yeah, and uh, let me know if uh, this perfume maybe reminds you of some other designer perfume. Is this a dupe for something? I would be interested to know because I haven't encountered this, uh, this type of scent in any of my other fragrances, like designer or otherwise. So uh, let me know if this reminds you of anything. And if you have it, if you like it, let me know in the comments. And uh, yeah, that's it. Just a quick review. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for thumbs up and subscribing to my channel. And I'll see you very soon. Bye.